A typical bottle of Petrus 2000 wine grown in Bordeaux, France will set you back about $6,000. But a bottle of Petrus 2000 which spent 14 months in space? That could cost you about a million. It's being called the first bottle of wine aged in space, but really it's one of 12. From November 2019 to January 2021, a dozen bottles of Petrus 2000 wine were stashed aboard the International Space Station, where some very disciplined astronauts didn't drink them. These bottles of Bordeaux sat in storage, subjected to a low-gravity environment and increased cosmic radiation for more than a year, before returning home in a SpaceX capsule. Scientists know that the stresses of space accelerate genetic changes in humans and animals. With this experiment, the private company Space Cargo Unlimited wanted to see if time in orbit prematurely aged wine as well. Back on Earth, a panel of wine experts and scientists convened to find out. In a blind taste test, the panelists sipped a glass of the space-aged Bordeaux alongside a glass of the same vintage which had never left Earth. According to panelist and wine writer Jane Anson, there was a clear difference. The space-aged wine tasted a bit more evolved than the terrestrial wine, she said, as if it had aged an extra two or three years during its time in space. If you want to put her review to the test, head over to Christie's. Their bottle of space-aged booze comes with a custom space-themed wine trunk, a bottle of terrestrial Petrus for comparison, and a corkscrew carved from a meteorite. This bundle is expected to sell for about a million dollars, and some of that money will be used to fund future space wine experiments by Space Cargo Unlimited. If that price is too rich for you, just be content in knowing that, for an entire year, there was a small cellar of fine French wine orbiting high over your head.